I'm Matt Rothschild, the senior editor of the Progressive Magazine, with my Progressive Point of View, which you can also grab off our website over at Progressive.org. John Kerry isn't exactly inspiring confidence as Secretary of State. He's become the biggest cheerleader for war against Syria. At the Senate hearings this week, he wouldn't even rule out putting boots on the ground in Syria, even though President Obama had assured us on Saturday that this wouldn't happen. Asked directly about it, here's what Kerry had to say. If chemical weapons were at risk of falling into the hands of al-Qaeda types in Syria, he said, I don't want to take off the table an option that might or might not be available to a president of the United States to secure our country. He then backtracked and tried to slam the door shut on putting U.S. ground troops there, but if you were listening, you had to conclude that this door is still kind of open. And anyway, why are we taking action that might help al-Qaeda types who are opposed to Assad? Once more, a majority of the American public doesn't want war, and once more, the political class is intent on dragging us into it. To be sure, if it's proven that Assad used chemical weapons, that would be a war crime. But remember, at the Nuremberg trials, Justice Robert Jackson said the greatest war crime of all was waging an aggressive war. And that's what John Kerry and Barack Obama seem prepared to commit unless we organize and stop them. I'm Matt Rothschild, and that's how I see it.